you see the article. Man who died allegedly after eating gecko on dare had rotted from the inside, family says. Now that's some type of vengeance right there. You know, this 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 gecko gecko was not going out without a fight. This is a way to take out your enemies, man. You know, come back for them. This gecko says, I'll be back on a dare. Now, I'm going to read this short article for you. And I know this is a stupid article. I started out dumb, right? I understand. I completely understand that. But does this go to show that white folks eat anything? And we're living in a time where there's black people that would actually follow white people. They would actually try to outdo white people doing stupid things. An Australian family is still grieving over the unexpected loss of their father who fell gravely ill allegedly after eating a gecko on a dare. David Dowell was reportedly challenged to eat the small lizard at a Christmas party last year and was rushed to the hospital two days later in absolute agony now if you're at a christmas party man the last thing you want to do is eat a gecko and all the food that's there they had to offer a challenge and people take challenges too far right now it's not always wise to accept certain challenges the father should have known better than this right and being in the military, I've seen some white dudes, man, eat some crazy things on a dare. I've seen white dudes eat lizards. I've seen them eat bugs. I've seen them eat worms alive, right? So we're living in a time now where people accept any type of challenge, man, just to get views, just to get notoriety. And I'm, I'm thinking that this father might have wanted some cool points. He wanted to still be the cool dad, right? And you don't have to eat a gecko to be cool. Just be a dad. You're not gonna always be liked. You're not gonna always be respected as a dad. As long as you do the right thing and you remain in your lane, stay in your lane. One day your children will grow up and they will remember even the things that they disagreed with, they're gonna respect you because you've always been an upstanding guy. Now it says it was a dare, but I don't know if it was a serious one. Well, it was serious because the man now was dead. I was paying attention, but not really because it was a Christmas party and the kids were invited. Alira Becknell, the 24 year old's lifetime partner. Now, shouldn't you be exchanging gifts at a Christmas party instead of eating a gecko? But I'm gonna put a link to this article on the bottom. You guys can check it out for yourself. Feedback, tell me what you think. But where's the outrage, man? They ate the gecko geico or the geico geckos. So feedback, tell me what you think. Till next time, I'm fearless.